there's something strange about human nature where people want to hear the lyrebird imitate our sounds back to us. <laughs> if lyrebirds do mimic sounds of human origin in the wild, I want to find these birds and film it to show that the filming I did for Life of Birds is actually a true reflection of real wild behaviour. In some areas, the song sounds like something out of this world. The relationship between what they hear and what they actually mimic is not that clear. The birds have moved from the west side to the east side, where a lot of it was cleared. And in that time, the calls changed quite a bit. You could fast forward a couple of hundred years into the future, and as human encroachment continues, and hence industrial noise continues, it'd be fascinating to hear, you know, what other sounds they pick up. I've actually had one mimic my son. I've never heard anything with a live bird that I would class as a man-made sound. They believed to evolve from Antarctic beach forests so that it could actually display in open areas. As far as the live birds are concerned, they don't realise what's basically happening with their uh, habitat diminishing. Young children this day and age coming through have no understanding of their environment. So how are we going to manage the future if they don't know about their environment? As the dawn breaks, you hear the little yellow robins start and then the other birds come in and try to listen, waiting for that first lyrebird call. The lyrebird has the ability to remember all songs and it has the ability to be the peacemaker. Yeah.